the man to watch. Four goals in three games, you can't argue with that. The action. Hello everyone, great to have the pleasure of your company here at Bramall Lane. My name's Derek Ray, and delighted to have alongside me, as usual on these occasions, Stuart Robson. And we have action to bring you from the round of 16 in the Carabao Cup. It's Sheffield United taking on Manchester United. Yes, cheers Derek. Well, what an occasion it is for this club and its supporters. These are the games that they dream of. No doubt in they're the underdogs, but if they can frustrate them... Opportunity it is! There it is! And just the ideal start! Well, it's a decent goal, but the defenders certainly played their part. Where were they? They were absolutely all over the place. And the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Lang. This looks promising. But really sticking to their task defensively. John Fleck. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. And room now out on the wing. Well, great read there to intercept. Losing possession here. Martial. Oh, big chance. Well, the keeper was called upon and delivered. Well, he's so good in those 1v1 moments, and he's proved it yet again. Who can they pick out? Well, nothing untoward happened. Well, they're sitting ever deeper. Martial. And a penalty awarded. Spot kick coming up. And it has been judged to have been a bookable offence. Well, I think the referee's got that right all round. It was a penalty and it was a yellow card. Can they extend their lead? guessed correctly and saved it and now the delivery just the clearance that was called for Muller and he read it well defensively Muller Muller and it goes delighted to be two in front Things look good for them now. Well, here's the replay, and he's got to clear his lines there. He doesn't do that. He has his pocket picked, and he's been rightly punished. Poor defending. Manchester so the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Thomas Muller. Not totally confused as opponent. And given away. Concession Walker, please go to the ticket office to meet Nathan. Thank you. Who can he pick out? Muller! And still an opportunity. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Just wanted to get it out of there. And a very good challenge. Applying vigorous pressure. Martial. 
Having won the ball back, they might be... Opportunity! Well, the keeper performing brilliantly. Well, that's just incredible. He reacted so quickly there. So the corner played into the box. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. Jones. Nicely timed tackle. Martial! And up for grabs off the keeper. Well, good defending. Clattered out of there. Well, I have to say, United have been a joy to watch today. Just look at those stats. They've been in complete control. Good tackle. Possession lost by Sheffield United. A real opening now. A goal! How about that? He's put it away to make it a hat trick. Well, here it is again, and they've taken their goal well, but the defending was non existent. That should never happen. So on with the game again, United in charge, the scoreline threatening to get ugly. Good looking sequence, can he do it? And fine goalkeeping. And over it comes, attending to his defensive chores. Given away by Manchester United. Well, on the cusp of the half-time interval, and I think it's fair to say they're enjoying this away day. Stuart, what have you made of what you've seen? Well, what a totally dominant performance this has been so far. Their attacking play has been a joy to watch. They've passed it forward at the right times, they've switched play quickly, and we've seen some great individual displays as well. I don't think they're let up in the second 45. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Jaden Sancho. Can he convert? Superb block. Half time then. That brings the first half to a close here at Bramall Lane. And they kick off here. So the ball moving again. United having already made a big first half statement. Possession one. Throw in then to Sheffield United. wide from there a pity really and United will switch things around personnel wise an unforced error you've got to say and he takes it on no problems for the keeper Müller well we always enjoy bringing you live action on EA TV and Premier League action coming up it's Manchester United facing Aston Villa that looks a really entertaining game. Two good teams with two excellent coaches. I can't wait for that one to come round. Müller. Well, lovely work to get past his man. And he's through here. Another goal! The lead grows to four now. A rampant display.
Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And then Thomas Muller does the rest. He hits... Through the back of the ball with such power. What a great finish. United have been getting two substitutes ready, and both will come on. Manchester well, it's been such a one-sided game. You just wonder how many more they could add. Wout Weghorst. Oh, what an opportunity. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Coming off the pitch, number 10, Billy Sharp, to be replaced by number 7, Rian Brewster. Good use of advantage in United's favour. Well, it wasn't much of an advantage in the end. And he's retrospectively awarded the free kick. Thumps clear. Superbly read and executed. Now the pressure being exerted. The high press was on and that's a fantastic tackle. It's there for him. And that is defending of the highest order. Mane. Can he finish? Oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals. No let up here. Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end. Oh my goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. Lisandro Martinez. On to Weghorst. He just missed that little bit of attacking spark. Goalkeeper's ball. It's looking promising. And a goal! He's put it away! A celebratory moment! Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. The ball rolling again in what has been an utterly one-sided match. Well, United have certainly controlled the ball, as you can see. And they've made good use of it. They really have played some good... Oh, hang on, Stewart, it's a chance. And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Brewster. No luck for Sadio Mane. Fleck. Oh, he's through here. A goal! We're really being spoiled. This is attacking football at its finest. Well, here we can see it again, and he does so well to skip beyond the defender. It just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. Goal for Manchester United. Number 11, Sadio Mane. Just 15 minutes remaining. Mane. Given away by Manchester United. Mane, chances on, and that's the hat-trick, tearing apart this defence time and again, they simply can't handle him.
Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Great strong tackle. Throw in forthcoming. Mane. Well, he stopped them in their tracks. Ten minutes to go. Mane in with a chance. Ball is loose. It's opened up for him. And off the post. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Played over. Putting his body on the line. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Osborne. He's in with a chance. But it was down to whether or not he could beat the keeper. And that question has been answered. Well, I'm all for players striking through the back of the ball with power. But he has to hit the target from there. Not much time to make up his mind. Lang. And he's in. Not to be for him. He went for power. Over placement. Well, you're right. He decided to go for the power, which in the end he couldn't control. He'll be furious with himself. That's a big miss. Baldock. It's with John Fleck. And the referee is going to add on four added minutes. Well, a shame that he couldn't find the target from there. Marcel Zabitza. Sadio Mane now. And he might be through here. Majestic piece of goalkeeping. Well, he loves the big moments, doesn't he? And he's proved it again there. Great goalkeeping. Who's going to get on the end of it? Just made sure nothing came of that. The final whistle, and Manchester United move on. Yeah, it doesn't come much easier than that, does it? Uh, just a moment of your time. Thank you for your time, really appreciate it.
often described as a man for all seasons. I'm talking about Thomas Müller. Four goals last time. Hello, everyone, and welcome. Our footballing travels have taken us to the Midlands. We're at Villa Park. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Aston Villa versus Manchester United. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? Oh, that's an interesting pass. Well, that's gone out, and it is going to be a goal kick. But as we glance at the table, it really is shaping up to be a captivating season, highly competitive, especially at the summit. Well, what a great title race this looks like being. Yes, there's a long way to go, but it's difficult to split these teams at the moment. Let's hope I'm right. And teammates around him. But quick thinking defensively. Well, if the form book has its say, every reason to believe Thomas Müller will make a big impact here, Stuart. Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly... In now, hold on, Stuart, they're in here. He had to score, and he does. Well, let's take another look. If you lose the ball in those areas, you're going to get punished. And that's exactly what happened there. Underway once more. Manchester United have hit the front. Veghorst. Opportunity here. That is a tackle and a half. Manchester United unable to hold on to the ball. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. Buendia. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And a free kick awarded by the referee. Coutinho. The supporters want to see him have a go. Oh, did so well to deny him. Coutinho's corner. Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long, and this match is level again. Well, here's the replay. It's certainly a well-delivered ball into the area, and it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Out of play, United throw in coming up. Can he put them in front? And putting his body on the line. Well, it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Vechorst. Might jump in front. And keeping it out. And cleared off the line. Off the post and back in play. Can he finish? And a goal! No less than they deserve. Well, here's the replay, and you can see why the manager is furious. It's just really poor play. Offering up possession far too easily in a dangerous area. And at this level, if you keep doing that, you're going to get punished. It's just not good enough. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the scoreline. Well, it appears there's been a goal in the Bournemouth game. Over to Alex for the details. It's a goal for Bournemouth. It was a volley that was mishit. It totally fooled everyone, including the goalkeeper. They're the first on the score sheet here with 23 minutes Now played. jumping in because this could be promising for them. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Well, sincere apologies for having to cut you off just then, Alex. 
to confirm Bournemouth have scored in that game and their lead stands at 1-0 presently what's he going to do here Muda well a top-notch piece of defensive judgment can't argue with that little move the horse can he put it in and that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. No problems grabbing hold of that one. Bubakar Kamara. Take it away. And he keeps going. A glorious chance. He can't hold on to it. Well, nothing untoward happened. Opportunity for Muller. And there it is, the goal they wanted for security. They lead by two now. They can breathe that bit more easily. Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. So they get the ball moving again. 3-1 the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? Valentin Rogier. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. The high press was very much on. What's he going to do here? Muller. Opportunity for Muller. He's gone and found the net! Brilliant piece of finishing! Magnificent goal! Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then just look at the finish. That's a brilliant volley. Good technique and the perfect contact. Well, this is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. And intercepted it. Valentin Rogier. Zavica. And he saw the situation developing. It's a good looking ball in behind. Could it be? And tremendous goalkeeping. Well, he just made it so difficult for the striker. His presence alone just caused him a problem. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Well, that's the end of that for now. Good pressure high up the pitch. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two. Can he take advantage? Oh, and it goes! Now he has his hat-trick. A special moment for him. Well, here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. And there goes the half-time whistle. That will do it for the first half here at Villa Park. Well, you know, there's something wonderfully old-fashioned about Thomas Mut. And so the second half is underway. They took quite the thrashing in that first 45. Can they turn things around now? Lang. Veghorst. Failed to keep hold of it.
They've given it away. Dinia. Very quick thinking there. Veghorst. Oh, showing excellent vision. Timely intervention. Oh, in with a chance. A goal! We're really being spoiled. This is attacking football at its finest. Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power, but just look at the follow-through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. So they restart the game, and only one team in it. Lang. Back with Weghorst. Müller. Cross could be useful. Well, such a high degree of difficulty, not quite in the end. Well, how good was that? It's such a difficult piece of skill, which he made look so easy. That deserved a goal. Well, as you can see, United have been really good going forward. They've created so many chances, and if they score again soon, it could become very embarrassing. Yes, the chances just keep on coming. No stopping them, apparently. Oh, surely... Still alive, in it goes, at the second time of asking, and the keeper feels hung out to dry. Well, let's take another look at this. From the attacking point of view, everything is right. The shot across the goalkeeper making it difficult for him, players coming in for the rebound, it's an excellent... Excellent goal, and the keeper could do nothing about it. Thirty minutes left for play. Going well. Free kick awarded then by the referee. Well, not quite the tantalising free kick he was hoping for. Goalkeeper's ball. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Mane. This is looking threatening. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw-in. Just going to be a double substitution. Making sure nothing came of it. Not a good pass. And we very much hope you'll join us for more live Premier League action on EA TV. It's Aston Villa facing Nottingham Forest. Given away by Manchester United. Well, it could be on for him here. Pivotal moment defensively. Coutinho. No difficulties encountered by De Gea. Bruno Fernandes. Sancho now. Happy just to retain the ball in their own half and draw out the opposition. Tyrone Mings. They've lost it. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. On full marks for trying, but very deftly cut out. Real chance. 
But I have to say, that was begging to be put away. Well, I was never known for my finishing ability, but I would have put that away. That's a shocking finish. Here's a change for Manchester United. And news of a goal at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. Alex, tell us all about it. It's a goal for Spurs. No one was marking him. He had too much time, and it was a simple finish in the end. They've pulled one back with 79 minutes played. The game has been fascinating so far, Derek. Cheers, Alex. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Jones. Now with Weckhorst. Just the challenge that was required. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. Setting off perhaps a little bit too much here. Oh, in with a chance! Oh, there it is! It's one goal after another, and it speaks to the quality of that performance. Well, as you can see, the defending is all over the place. That's far too easy for the attackers. The goalkeeper's got absolutely no chance there. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Ollie Watkins. Nicely timed tackle. Now oh, that pass easy on the eye. Is it going to be? And not cleared away properly. And top notch as well as brave goalkeeping. Well, he comes off his line at just the right time. He read that brilliantly. And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. Valentin Rogier on to Moreno. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. Alex Moreno. Rogier. Can he finish? And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at their best. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. And that is the end of the game. It goes down as a United triumph. No fans are going to be happy with this. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and... Just grab a minute of your time for a few questions. No further questions, thanks.
Hi, good to see so many of you here. Questions one at a time, please. Okay, guys, thank you so much.